Yes, sir. You already know this your boy behaves. We back with another one. Let's go ahead and get right into it. You know, I don't like to waste nobody time. Today, we're going to be touching bases on Teal Ray. That's ticket symbol T L R Y. I told y'all. I ain't want to say I told y'all asses, but I told y'all. I always exaggerate all the videos when I called out the hot stocks and told y'all what to put on your watch list. Every time I got the Teal Ray, I exaggerated and like let y'all know that y'all yeah, real hyped about Teal Ray. So, I hope y'all got in on this. I hope y'all made money. You know, this is not financial advice. I'm not your financial advisor, but I be showing y'all what behave you doing. So, y'all, you know, everybody more than welcome to, you know, do everybody. Just pick, I always tell y'all, just pick the stocks that you comfortable with, the stocks that you can relate to. Because when you all over the map trading all these tickers or investing in all these different tickers, like you ain't got no, really no good outcome, no positive outcome. Be comfortable with what you invested in. Like, you know, do your homework on it. Make sure that you believe in the company, that you actually like the company. Because if it tank, if it start falling, you're going to be scared and panic because you don't even believe, you don't even know what the company got going on. So, you know, take your time and actually, because I be calling out a whole lot of stocks. That don't mean go and buy every last single one of them. You know, take the time and, oh, I like the stock he's talking about today. That sound up my alley. Let me, you know, participate in that in that one. And the ones that you that you more comfortable with, with that you can relate to, you're going to do better as a trader. You're going to do better as an investor, a better all around in this investing field. So let's go ahead and get right into it, though. You know, I like to waste y'all time, but I like to give y'all gems on, game, on the game around this whole you know this whole aspect of this business so let's, let's jump into it y'all the day tilray we opened up at 2525 the high was 27 dollars and 76 cent the low was 24.90 the 52 week high was 67 dollars the 52 week low was 243 okay let's check it out let's see what type of uh news tilray drop they just dropped some news yesterday on February the 23rd, say Afiria and Tilray announce launch of www.afiriatilraytogether.com. So, uh, Tilray and Afiria, if I'm saying that's wrong, somebody can correct me in the comments like last time. But I'm saying Afiria, I don't really know how to pronounce it. Afiria and Tilray announced they, they launch. So, they got a website together. And basically, the website is where investors like myself and you guys if you invested in them we can go there and like participate in and like meetings and stuff and like just giving you the feel of being a real investor inside a company you can go there and they got a lot of we can just browse through and see what they got going on you can get go to meetings and stuff and all that good stuff so let's check it out it's a tilray a global pioneer in cannabis research cultivation production and distribution are pleased to announce the launch of the website www.afiriatilraytogether.com. This new dedicated resource seeks to provide shareholders of both companies with pertinent information, news, and updates leading up to the special meetings of shareholders at which Afiria's and Tilray's respective shareholders will vote on the resolutions necessary to implement the proposed business combination of the two companies, the transaction. The website will also allow shareholders and other interest, interested parties to register for transaction updates that are made publicly available so they receive information directly to their email addresses. So, you know, Tilray and Afiri got this website together. It's for the companies and for the public, for retail investors. So, you know, go check it out if y'all want to. So now let's carry on, y'all. You know, we like to see what the analysts, what Wall Street, what they target is on the stock. Let's see what they got to say. The 11 analysts offering 12-month price forecast for Tilray have the median target of $22 with a high estimate of $34 and a low estimate of $8.50. The median estimate represents a negative 18% decrease from the last price of $26.98. You already know what I told y'all. They like to hate on these companies in public, but they be buying in private. So let's go ahead and see. Let's see what they got going on. Institutional ownership, 14.7%. Increased positions, 11.7 million shares. Decreased positions, 3.2 million shares. 
held positions, 10.2 million shares. Total institutional shares, 25.2 million. Out of 25.2 million, they decreased their position, 3.2 million shares. New position, 6.8 million shares. Sold out position, 900,000 shares. Now let's check out, let's check out my position. I told y'all, I told y'all I was getting in on this. I told y'all I was heavy. I was heavy on Tilray. I would have bought more. I would have actually bought more than what I bought, but I got hit. My account took a little, uh, nice little hit during the pullback when everything fell, when everything was on sale, when we went shopping. You know, I got hit. I got hit a couple times. So, you know, we coming back up, though. We going to make up for what we got hit for plus more. So let's check it out, y'all. We in Tilray, we got a total cost of 8500 Average price, $24. Last price, $29.62. We up almost $2,000. $14 shot of two bands. And that's our position. So now, for the ones that's, you know, thank you late to the party or wondering if you late to the party, Let's check out the chart. Let's see what this thing headed for the short term and the long term. So okay. Right here, we done blew past $29.54. We done blew past that. We had $29.62. And that's why I had Mark on the chart for us to get through, for us to be still in the bullish trend. So when we passed that $29.54, right here where I got Mark on the chart, you see in after hours, we done ramped up and passed that. So that means we could possibly see a push in the morning for pre-market, we could see a push right over here to this support. This our, this would be our new support line right over here where we was at on February 22nd. We had a good support here before we fell off a cliff. So this could be our support again right here at $27. If early in the morning, I feel since we done broke, since we already broke that $29.54, where I got marked on the chart, we done broke past that. So our next area would be to $27 range. We'll hit that 27 I feel we'll farm that support there. And then if we keep going from there, if we keep going from 27 once we hit it, we could go straight up to 30 to 30 $31. We go straight up to the $30 range, $31.30, $31. And then if we have any kind of pullbacks, is what I'm saying, our new farm support would be at 27 I don't think we're going to see 23 24 25 dollar range no more with tilray so that was your chance to get it i been put y'all on it you feel me even if you did get on it you could consider taking profit tomorrow and getting back in on a pullback on a nice deal but it'd be something to consider because this is a long-term hold especially with they just now legalized weed in new jersey so let's carry on well that's all well, that's all I really got for y'all this video. But I will give y'all this pointer. If it, anybody new that's that's that feel like they missed out and they don't want to get FOMO and chase and they need an entry point to get in on this play, a good entry point to get in on this will be let me look at it. Let me look at it in real time. Twenty nine sixty. If you was to get in on this. I say a good, good spot to get in would be. I would want to see it pull all the way back to twenty, the twenty-six to the twenty-six dollar range. Yeah, I would, I would, I would have to have patience and, and wait to that twenty-six dollar range. Cause I would nibble right then. I boom, put my first position in at that twenty-six, and then if it pulled back to twenty-four, twenty-five, which we might never see, but you never know. You got to be prepared in the stock market. Then I add more. Or, I mean, I, I, long term, weed is going through the roof. So, I mean, now is still a good price. But you don't want to chase. Right now, it be considered chasing. It done ran up. But this thing, been, we know it been hit hard. And all these stocks run together. That's why I try to tell y'all. I told y'all when, like, how AMC took off, I gave y'all another stock, a Symphony play, that's going to run with AMC. Like, you got to know this type of stuff. Whenever one stock start running or one set to start running, you got to know what to look for for something else that's about to run. That's how people beat y'all to the party, be there early, because they know they go off of what's running. We kind of can figure out what's going to run next. You feel me? So, you know, just just do your, be on your game. I'm trying to put y'all on game. You already know. You already know how we do over here. 
So if you like these type of updates, these type of predictions, you already know what's going on. You found the right spot. Consider joining the family. And this your boy Behaves. Y'all already know. We out. God bless.